Okay, in this video we'll see how to uh, create a repository. We have a Spring Boot Java application here and we'll see how to initialize a git on a local repository and we'll create a new repository on the GitHub and push the code to the GitHub repository. So first we need to create a new repository and then we need to say it's expense tracker it will be used to manage our daily expenses and incomes and we'll say create repository okay so we have this repository and github gives us this code to push our existing repository from the command line so here what we need to do first is uh, we need to go to our existing folder okay and open git bash here okay and then use this command git in it okay there will be a git dot git file folder created okay in a repository so now what we need to do is git add git status to see the files which we are going to commit then git add dot okay then git commit dash m commit the files shall commit okay once we do this initial commit now what we need to do is we need to go to the github and we need to copy this code okay we need to copy this code and we need to let's clear this first we need to add this here okay once we add this then next what we need to do is we need to again go to the github and use this command okay and again go to the github and push the data so dash u means it will create a new upstream to push the data so you can see that uh, uh, code is pushed to the git and if we go here now and reload this we can see the code has been pushed next we'll also see how to create a developed branch uh, on this uh, main branch so now what we would do is okay to create a new branch from this let's use this command here and this will create a develop branch now let's say git status here and we'll push the data to the main branch so we'll use this command to push the data to the main uh, develop branch so once we push the data we can go to the develop branch and see that we have the files which are pushed to the uh, develop branch so what we had done is we had used uh, dash u that is the upstream to push the push the data to the uh, develop branch okay and whenever we do new changes we will do it in the develop branch and then merge it to the main branch we'll push it to the develop branch and then we'll merge it to the main branch 